Hey Panthers, welcome to the Forest Fire. I'm Andrew. And I'm Sarah. Today is Friday, March 19th, 2010. Let's check in with Alicia and Emily Bernard about the senior video. Who has an announcement to make about the senior video. Okay, there is a big problem. I asked for pictures by next Friday before we go into spring break. I have gotten about five people giving me pictures and that is it out of the entire senior class. If anyone wants to be in the video, they need to send me pictures because if you're not in it, don't come complaining to me when you're not in it because it's your decision to give it to me. So, yeah, that's all I have to say to all the seniors, class of 2010. Thanks, Emily. If you seniors want to be in the senior video, you better send your pictures to Emily Renard. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Lisa. Let's check out what's in the inbox. Seniors who are interested in applying for the Corey Matthew Books Memorial Scholarship should see Dr. J or Ms. Bossily to pick up an application. Spring conditioning for cheerleading will begin April 12th and go from Monday through Thursday at 345 to 515 in the mini gym. It is not required. The cheerleading clinic will be held through Monday, May 3rd and end on Thursday. Trial outs are on May 7th. Project Lighthouse is looking for donations of food and clothing. They are due the last day before spring break in the weight room, or A113. The National English Honor Society will meet next Monday, April 22nd, in C108. All members, please plan to attend for some impo important information. Any student that has taken broadcasting, journalism, yearbook, or newspaper first semester may go to the SC SBA meeting on April 26th. <laughs> See Ms. Herring for more information. Carolina Forest High School hosted our first annual golf tournament at Quail Creek and placed fifth out of 17 teams. All Anchor Club members that have Corey Matthew Brooks scholarship raffle tickets out need to please turn the ticket money into Dr. Jacobs in the room F108 prior to spring break. Seniors, if you attended prom last year, you still need to get a receipt, but we cannot process the ticket. Juniors and seniors, prom tickets are going up weekly. Buy now or start a payment plan. That's the inbox. Let's check in with Lou for our Panther Sports. Thanks, Andrew. Now let's check out what's going on with our Panther Sports. There's a varsity baseball and softball game away against Sumter at 630. The Varsity Boys and Girls Soccer Team has a home game against Hartsfield starting at 5.30. Now we're going to check in with Donna. She interviews Emily Diaz off the Varsity Soccer Team. Diaz from Girls Varsity Soccer. So I heard you guys won your game last night. How'd it go? It went really well. It was our first win of the season, and it was against one of our arch rivals, so it, was, it felt really good to beat them. Were there any outstanding players? Um, yes, our outstanding players were mostly our forwards, but it couldn't have been without the help of our defense and our midfield. Well, are there any games coming up? Um, yes, we have a home game on Friday against Hartsville, so everyone should come out and support us. Well, make sure you come out and congratulate the girls' soccer team. Back to you guys in the studio. Thanks, Don. Now let's go back to Sarah and Andrew for the forecast and lunch. Thanks, Lou. Now let's go check out the daily forecast. Today is partly cloudy with a high of 73 and a low of 43. Monday, there will be a few showers with a high of 63 and a low of 40. For lunch today, they'll be serving... Beef burrito, lettuce, tomato, cheese, corn, fruit, or fish sandwiches with fries. Subscribe to the show at www.youtube.com slash CFHS Forest Fire. Thanks for watching the Forest Fire and have a free Friday. Friday.